Hi everyone, it is Super Thing Games here, back with another video, and I just want to say two, thank you guys so much for 200 subscribers. It's really been, it really means a lot to me, and um, yeah, so um, this, you know, you read the title and thumbnail, look at it if you haven't. Um, I am going to be unboxing a salt and plushie. And the reason why I'm going so fast is because I've been having to record this intro for so long because, um, for so many attempts because, um, I keep on doxing myself. But I mean by that, I keep on so showing my address on my, on the label. And so anyway, I just want to say thank you guys so much, um, for 200 subscribers. And I know in the community tab, let's say that while I open this, um, that's not my address. Um, kind of is, but not really. Um, you guys, the community post I made, um, you guys aren't just getting uh, this unboxing. You guys are also getting um, a plus episode. Uh, episode. Oh my god, okay, I already opened him, and um, I can't dox myself. And... weak little baby just kidding uh don't do that out of the context please oh this is very dirty so if you look at it very soft apparently it has oh the tag it's kind of uh, like can you see that it's kind of scratched up i guess but it's still at least it has it it's the og super mario um, font, I guess, so logo, 2011, little buddy. The tag just looks different from, um, all the other ones. If we look at this one, the, like, the layout is a bit different, I guess. Little buddy, and then look, if we look at, we'll say an all-star one. So, actually, I mean, it might be the same. I might be going crazy. No. Yeah, it's it's just a little different, I guess. No, it's the same. A little different, but, you know. So, it's very soft. It's just very dirty, if you can tell. As you can see. And, oh, I should probably be using my tripod. Oh, my God, he's a big fella. He's a mighty good fellow. Uh, okay, um, I don't want to get copyrighted. So, um, he is very... Oh, I didn't mean to do that. He is very damaged. Like, his overall came off. He's so soft. He is nice and bordery. He looks very beautiful. The only thing about him <clears throat> is he's very dirty. And he's in good condition besides all the dirt and like, you know, that. It's very soft. Like the fabric is very soft besides all the, yeah, it's very soft. But, oh, I, I wanted to see. <gasps> yes, you can see his skin like the Mario Party 5 one. Okay, to be honest, I kind of thought he'd be a little bit bigger, but... Oh my god, he's like a baby. Oh my goodness. That's like half my height, I guess. Uh, hold on. Let me. Yeah, I'll say that's like about like half my height, if you want to say. Maybe a little less than half. I don't know. I know he's like 22 inches. Um, I'm sorry, I promised you all the attention in the world. It's just, I'm kind of doing something right now. Maybe later, I'm sorry. He doesn't have any of the buttons either, so I'm going to have to make buttons. Uh, and that's kind of nice. I'm going to fix that. Oh, Lucy, I'm sorry. Um, the mustache is good. Besides some things here and there, but... For the most part, his embroidery looks really nice. This is my first ever Sine Jumbo Mario plush because the 
This isn't my first ever like jumbo plush, jumbo Mario plush because if you want to count the jump, sorry, if you want if you want to count the Better Bell Bowser as a jumbo, but it's just an, not so me. And this is my jumbo Mario. Uh, it's the it's the good stuff. No, 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 not good stuff. It's the other company. Um, wow, what's it called? It made my bluey pillow. Uh, hold on, I'm sorry. Uh, Franco, the one that made the the company that made the. Jumbo Freddy Fazbear, but I don't have that one yet. So this is like 20 inches, I believe, or like 22. So, oh my God, it's smaller. I thought that they would be like the same size. Uh, yeah. Well, actually, they basically are. This one's just a bit bigger, I guess, more like wide. But like, it is a bit like taller. Well, actually, yeah, you know, this one's like maybe a couple inches taller with the hat, like that, just that. So technically, yeah, this is a little, yeah, this is big old. But for qual, uh, like um, softness wise, this one's way softer than this like fabric. Um, then yeah, at least this one has buttons. The overalls are good. <laughs> But, well, actually, you play. Yeah, and this one, you can't do that, which is really cool in my opinion. Um, oh my god! Uh, I, so, if you wanted to, you could make him completely naked, like all the, oh, the Mario Party 5 Mario and Luigi plushies, I believe. Yeah. So that's really cool how they do that. Um, I don't want to know what's underneath here. Besides to No, that's like probably from like, um, the previous owner. This was like $30. Including shipping. Shipping was $18. Like, and the plush beat as... So it was like around $40. Um, if you want to say. So, um, the overall goes over here around his thing. So it would look like that. <coughs> Um, obviously I'm gonna have to fix them. Might take a while, so you might not see this video for a while. Um, it's kind of, kind of stitched weird, but as jumbo plushies, you know, it's like, um, more higher quality, I guess, because it's not just like, it actually looks like hail, which I guess, because it pops out from like the skin. Even though the, the other ones, the smaller ones do, it's um like just um glue. Yeah, it's just glue, as you can see. But this is actually sewn. And um, I can probably take off the hat. It's just, it would be like, yeah, it's sewn down. But like, you can see, it's like all the other plushies, he's bald. He has a receding hairline. Um, oh yeah, it's very dirty. I don't wanna give it a bath. I I might I don't know if I'm gonna give it a bath because that might make it less soft. But then again I didn't do that with my Bowser Jr. plushie or anything. Yeah, so his like all the materials are the same from um the regular like plushies. Um maybe soft or I don't know. Oh yeah, but um yeah, so the hat's like made of the same thing, inclu including the cushion that's inside. Um, I'm not going to take the hat off because, probably, first of all, I'll probably lose it. And second of all, I don't want to damage this more than it already is. His eyebrows are completely, no, just the outline all embroidered. Same as the eyes. Then they're completely embroidered. Like the tiny old versions. Well, I guess this would be more of a fair comparison. If we got the plushie that came around at, um, at, at around its time, or oh, the Mario plush that came at, and at during its time, if I can find it, I might not find it. I don't know what happened to. Oh, there's 
One of the Mayos. Uh, not the one I'm looking for. Uh, again, not the one I'm looking for. Uh, I may have to cut this. Ah, I just, oh my God. I just, um, I just ruined, uh, not ruined, but I just, um, bent that. Oh, no, um, I am just gonna have that. Oh my God, um, you, I'll just cut. I'm gonna have to cut this video anyway because I have to show you guys the finished product. Um, yeah, hold on. Okay, so a couple minutes later, uh, not only did I find the 2010 Ouija from the same set, um, I also found 2010 or 2010 Mario plush. I already reviewed these, so I'm not gonna go into too much detail. Yeah, he has the same though. I also talked about the the buttons are pretty good. Um, uh, and yeah, I'm gonna sidetrack. So as you can see, um, the details are the, like the same, including like the inside of the hat. You guys, can, you guys can't see, but uh, yeah, you can kind of see. It also has a receding hairline. Um, I don't want to show actually. I'm not sure. You can kind of see. Um, you can't, you know, see his skin through the overalls. Um, anyway, um, you know, so, um, this is, this, even though this came out a year later, it's probably, like, the all-star one where it came, like, later down the line. Um, oh, and I forgot to say, um, Little Blue Plush Films, or, um, Lobby Plush Studios, whatever, or Max, um, I think he has the Jumbo Yoshi. Yeah, he has the Jumbo Yoshi. I don't know if it's a Super Mario set one or if it's the all-star one it's one of the both one of the two um i'm not sure so um yeah and it's like about this size because so it's giant so um the mustache uh this might just be mine but the mustache is bumpy just um mario's fidget position i guess not really i guess uh, i keep on saying i guess i guess um yeah it's very beautiful um, they're both very soft, so yeah, they are all the same material. Yeah. So, um, yeah. There's not much to say. Um, I've been found that jumbo plushies, they would, like, add more hail to look like. Because in Mario Odyssey, oh, I guess another good example. I know these plushies came, this plushie came out later, but oh, this set came out later than these. And the, oh, oh, not it came before the awesome one, but after those, the Super Mario Wedding, or Super Mario Odyssey plushies have hail, like add um for the Mario add more hail to his like head, so it's he doesn't have like a receding hairline. I wish they do, would do that, at least on the jumbos. Or like a little bit, I don't know. I guess like the hat is covering it, so it wouldn't really matter, but. Anyway, uh, I'm getting sidetracked. That's not even related. So, um, the, yeah, the basic, this basically just ate a mega mushroom. Um, so like, I guess I can say, um, after this you just eat another regular mushroom and then you turn into that. So from this to the medium all-star Mario to that to this. Uh, if you want to shortcut it, you can do this to that. Or this to that and then that. Oh yeah, whatever. Um anyway, so um it is very dirty right here. That's not just the shadow. It's very dirty. Look, look at that line. There's a reason Mario wears, wears gloves. The glo whole glove, this whole like right arm is dirty. Some of his face is dirty. All of his glove is dirty. Uh, yeah, all of his right arm. I guess like some of his, uh, I don't know if that's just me, but it looks like some of his um, overall is dirty. Um. I should probably make him naked. Just kidding, I won't get any good damage back. Um, that's pretty good. Um, yeah, the, 
I guess the back side is pretty good. Um, it's a little, oh yeah, you can see that line, that perfect straight symmetrical line. So yeah, I probably shouldn't have this on my bed, but whatever. Um, I guess it's not like the skin, it's just like, you know. Um, the, oh, and what I like about these is the shoes, the like soles have more detail on like the sides instead of just being like the bottom, you know? And like how the plushies are. I guess you can see the sole, but like, you know, like these are more detailed, I guess. Um, but yeah, because it, you know, the big one. These isn't, it, it isn't necessary, but like on this, it, this also isn't necessary, but it just adds because like, you know, like that part, I guess, I don't know. Um. Okay, I'm getting sidetracked. Oh, like, um, the, that side part right there, the right part. Um, anyway, um, I'm getting sidetracked. The tag is good besides that little, like, scratch. But that's that's fine because some plushies have that, but not all. Um, I know that. Um, the mustache has six bumps, which is really good. It's really big. Put this on a regular Mario plush, it would look like um the SMG4 Mario. Um, so um, yeah, I, I don't know how the buttons fall off without it looking amazing. Unless I like, how how do you get the guru off? And I I don't know. Like the buttons look like they were never there in the first place. Besides that, like little, you can kind of see like how it was, but. I don't know, like, it looks like it was never there. There's never a circle, because it's not, like, glue residue or whatever. It's kind of, that's weird. And, um, I'm gonna, I don't know, I'm not blind, but, like, I'm not, like, yippee, you're Because, I don't know. Uh, so it would look like that, but just imagine buttons. I don't know how to make buttons, not, like, Kind of thick, thick. Um, yeah. So imagine like that. I'm um, something. This thread is coming loose, so I'm just gonna have to like sew it down really quick. Um, I said it would be an unboxing and like cleaning of this, but I'll probably do most of the cleaning off camera because I don't want this video to be so long. I was supposed to do, I was gonna do like a live stream, but like, I don't know. Um, I probably no one would watch that. A live anyway. Yeah, I just like how like, it, it's just, since it's sewn in, it just looks so much poofier, I guess, more 3D than I guess you can say these. Um, this arm is, not dirty, oh, besides that, and some right here, so it is dirty. So both of the arms are dirty. Um, should I cut this off? So that, okay, I might regret this, but I'm gonna cut it off so um he can be naked. Ah, oh, I might regret this. No, I can always sew it back. Okay, you know, whatever. Um, the damage has been done. I'm sorry. Uh, I wanna see if you can get naked. Hold on. Okay, so um, I took it off. It was worth it because it looks exactly like the Mario Party 5 Mario and Luigi plushies. Because, um, the yeah, those plushies, and including the Jumbo, Medium, and regular size Mario, and then the regular size Luigi, and you can take off the overalls. It's not recommended unless you already did it like a long time ago. It's not recommended, but you know, you can do it. Uh, I did this on for him because, first of all, it was gonna. I, I did, this is just. I might even not even sew it on. I might just do Velcro. So, like, I can always, like. I don't know. I don't know if I'm gonna. I might do that. Because it would look be really cool to have it make it. <laughs> Um, so yeah, um, you know, it's just, uh, 
So he is dirty. Oh, his hair on the back. His back hair looks really good. Um, it's just wearing like a red shirt. Oh, my dad's home. Um, yeah, he's just like a uh, dirty on his butt. Uh, it has beans in it, so that's really cool. Um, yeah. I'll clean him and his overalls at another time. My dad's home, and so I should probably get going on my homework. And you might not know about this, but we'll worry about that later. Um, yeah. See ya. I might make a part two. I don't know. Hi, everyone. So, um, I know it's only been like a couple seconds for you, but for me, it's been like two days since I recorded the last scene of Jumbo Mario. And um, since then, uh, my mom, my yesterday, <clears throat> oh no, the day before yesterday, no, 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 today, Saturday, wait, no, no, yesterday, <clears throat> my mom washed him, um, but like we took off the overalls and then, um, like washed them at the same time. Oh, she did it. I was, I was at school, <clears throat> but so um, you know, he's clean. So since we took, oh, she, we took off the overalls and his, like, body got clean and his overalls separately. Well, like, they were in the same load, but you know what I mean? So the stain isn't, like, it's still there, but, like, it's not as bad, same as the gloves. And then he still has that tan line, I call it. But, you know, at least he's clean now. And those are just, like, stains, I guess. And, um, uh, so, um, yeah, today, um, we were on the hunt for buttons, because he need buttons, and I took, uh, we had to go to a main Walmart, they didn't have any single buttons, we went to Target, they didn't even have any buttons also, and then we went to, uh, a different Walmart, that's a bit farther away than the main, the one we usually go to, and, um, they had buttons. Uh, oh, I left them in my kitchen. Um, I'm gonna go get them and um, yeah. Okay, okay. So I got the buttons. Um, we had to buy um two packs. Um, because because um it comes out with, like one pack is like one of each color besides the blue, which for some reason it's kind of weird. Um, you may be like, where's the yellow? Um, here here are the yellow. So, and then um. The buttons needed to be like a, a little over an inch. And guess what? These are a little over an inch. And I think, hold on. I think that looks pretty, it could be a bit bigger. But I think that's pretty good. So, um, you give me a moment. I need to put the, the on that, but, but yeah, I'm gonna sew it on, but like in a bit. I just want to show you guys what it would look like with the button. It looks something like that. So I think, yeah, I try to get one, a bu the button, I try to get buttons like this. But um, they didn't have any like that, so I had to get these. At least, you know, at least we'll have buttons. They're not accurate to the actual plushie, but it's close enough. And plus, at least he have buttons instead of it just being empty. So I think that looks really good, in my opinion. Yes, they could have been a little bit bigger, but I, I feel like that's fine. That's that's good. At least you know the big enough. And yes, they all a bit bigger than the Fanco ones, I believe. Yeah, like a little bit bigger, if you can see. But that doesn't really do it justice, but they're like a little bit big old. If you can yeah. So like a little bit big old. Anyway. So uh I'm gonna um, sew these on. And if you're wondering how would these look on Oigo Mario Pond when they would look kinda weird. Mario was a mommy or something.
Um, yeah. Oh, and I guess, I guess, I'm kind of wasting time, I guess. I don't know. But if you want to see how they would look on the fan call one. Kind of unnecessary, but... Oh, that's not balanced. Okay, that's one. Okay. Yelly for the rescue. Yeah. Oh, there you go. So, that's what they would look like. Kind of weird. But, oh well, I'm gonna get sidetracked. Oh, I got, I got a release for a Sonic onesie, but <clears throat> off topic. <clears throat> I'm sorry, my dog <clears throat> keeps on doing that. My mom does they have acid reflux as well. Whatever. So, yeah, so I'm gonna sew these on. And so uh, I'll give you, oh, wait, by the way, the tag still looks amazing. Um, I'm gonna, I'll give you an update after I sew on this, and then I'm gonna do like a little patch of Velcro so that I can take on and off the buttons, and then I'll sew that on. Instead of hot gluing, because it would be, look more professional, and plus, there's no way I'm putting hot glue on this. So, um, like and subscribe, don't mind why that's so, um, and then, yeah. Okay, so um, it's only been like a minute. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take off his overalls because there is literally no reason why I need to bring his whole body. So I'm gonna take off his overalls. I'm glad you can do that. Uh, he's probably losing stuffing from his legs and I'm going to his butt. See how squishy it is compared to like this one, I guess. Okay, <clears throat> um, I'm gonna take off this one, for sure. This part of the overall. <clears throat> So yeah, this my this is how my mom washed him. He she she washed washed this and then this separately, but like in the same load, you know. Uh, so I'm just gonna sew them on here. So it will look like something like this. Hold on, look something like this. So. Oh, wait, yeah, yeah, uh, I gotta show you guys the example. You know what he did? Sorry about my brother screaming his little all out. He is so annoying. Look, so it looks like something. Um. Something like that, which I think would look pretty good. Yes, I think it would have been better if the button would like that. It would be more game accurate, I guess. You know, and it would actually be accurate to the plushie, but this is the closest thing I have. And, you know, anyway, uh, I'm going to do this. So I uh, like and subscribe in the meanwhile, and then I'll cut into... These are sewn on him. Oh, and sewn on to heel. Oh, I gotta get my sewing kit. Um, like and subscribe. I'll be right back. Okay, so that so that took me. It took me a while to find my sewing kit. I didn't find it, but I found like a a yellow thread and then um a needle. So that worked, I guess. Um, so uh, I sewed it on. My mom kind of helped me. Um, 
like knot it so that it looked professional. And um, you know, I did that. I did a square with an X, and then so now it has he has all um buttons. So hopefully it looks good now. And it's like secure. So um, let me put them on his eyeballs on, and I'll show you guys. And then I'm just gonna put um a patch of um Velcro on him. I don't know how we do that. I'd like sew a patch on him. I had to do that, and then like, and then uh, I'll do another little Velcro thing right here, and then he'll be done. So yeah, um, let me put it on him. Um, okay, hold on, give me one second. Hold on, I'm sorry, guys. Uh, okay, so um, I'll have to sew it on, but. This is basically how he looks. I think it looks really good. So um, yeah, I'll, uh, I'll update you guys when I pull the Velcro's on. I have to find the Velcro. I'll be right back. Okay, so um, it's been like two and a half or to um, three hours. So, because I had to sew on the, not the buttons, uh, the Velcro. And you know, blah blah blah. So um, and he is finished. He's all dressed up. So um, this is the smaller 2010 Super Mario set. Super Mario plush. Pretty cool. And then I have a review on this guy. If you don't know, same as the Luigi. Um, oh yeah, they came together. And then one year later, in 2011, when I was born, they will re release the Jumbo one, which you guys know because this whole video is about the Jumbo one. 2011 Jumbo one, oh, two, no, no, 2010 regular sized one. 2000, and then now 2011 Jumbo sized Mario plush. Stupid waddle, you mo ruins a good moment. Um, so yeah. He, I added the buttons that I showed you. Oh, you know, you guys already knew about that, but because I showed you. Um, and I stitched in fabrics. Oh, um, felt, um, no. Ah, what's it called? Velcro. So that's why you, there's like some holes though. Um, they're, they're not holes, they're just like where I sewed. So, um, and then, so you can see the Velcro underneath. So you can take off and off, take on and, no, no. You can take off and on his oval walls, which is really cool. And then I'm um, off camera, well, like later on, me and my mom are gonna, um, scrub the stains, but, I don't want this video to take forever and to be too long. So, um, yeah. It's like my Bowser Jr. plush, but I didn't show you all of it, like this one. But, um, because I cleaned him and, um, don't mind my bed. And then, um, I cleaned him. And then, like, I showed you guys the after, before and after, I guess. Or just, like, the before and then after. And so... Yes, they're not the same buttons as the action, the official, uh, well, the jumbo had, but this one had no buttons, so I had to get my own. And everywhere we looked, they only had like these type of buttons. Well, we only went to one, uh, one store, only had buttons, and they were these. So, probably could have had these buttons from like a different store, but hey, at least, you know, it looks good for what he is. Oh. Yeah, what he is. And I think I did a really good job on this. So if you guys can like and subscribe, please. I'm so happy. This took, all I need to get now is to, to get all the Mario, actually, the, like the regular Mario. Because if it was all the Marios, I would need the Fire Mario from the set. Which I'm probably gonna get one day to fit my 
Fire and Luigi on this set. So that like the size would kind of be would, would be better because the All Star Fire Mario is bigger than the original Little Buddy Super Mario set Fire Luigi because they never made the All Star Fire Luigi. Anyway, um, all I need now is the medium 2000 on um, the medium Super Mario set Mario Plus that I believe came out either like after yeah after this one. And oh, before this one, and before that one. So probably in between. Yeah, it's actually in between. So it's like the middle child, the baby, the middle, the jump, uh, the oldest. So I'll get that one next, and then like I'll have like the size. But for now, this is like the size going up with regular Mario, just regular Mario. So, uh. You could argue that uh, this one's a bit, yeah, this one's a bit like shorter, but like two inches. But like this one's just like more wide, I guess. And then, um, and then, um, oh wait. Technically, I do have a medium Mario. Oh, okay. Oh, yep. And about um, I'll start medium or oh, medium I'll start Mario. I don't know if I made an unboxing on him. I might have. I don't know. It's just the all-star one, but big old. Mine, mine snows, it's like really up. I never fix that, but you know, you just have to bit, put it down like that. And then it looks better. And then so, this, so, so far it's like this, like a little gap and then like a big gap and then like a, big gold or like a big also a big gap so yeah from this to this pretty yeah i put it that's pretty big and then this one the medium one is yeah so like you can say i wonder how this would look quadruple the size oh <laughs> um well, I should probably show you guys the All-Star Mario since that one is... And since I'm doing the medium All-Star Mario, so, um, this is an All-Star Mario. Not my... Oh, dear. My, my grandpa gave me this one. He got it at, like, a stall. So, um, so technically the older one goes like this. Hold on. So, um, and then this one, and then I think this one's, yeah, this one's a bit shorter. And then, if I am correct, I just have to find it. If I am correct, the new Super Mario Bros. Wii Mario is a bit smaller. Yeah. Yeah, he's, he's like a little bit smaller. So technically, and then uh, my my old main All-Star Mario, my original main Mario plush back in my early Mario channel days, I guess. Um, not my early channel days because that was like FNAF content. Um, whenever I started making Mario plush videos, I used an All-Star Mario plush, which my, was my f first ever. Well, no, it wasn't my first ever Mario. It was a good stuff, but you get the point. And I guess that's like, a, I think a little bit either bigger or smaller than this one. So this is basically the, well, actually, I don't know. You might want to just include him. So it could go like, ooh, or like, um, if you want, it could be like, or like,
Um, yeah. Hi, everyone. It's been a day since the last uh, clip, I guess. So, um, and then last night, when I, before I went to bed, um, I tried to, like, take off his um, overall thing again. Just to, you know, test it. And um, it, it started coming off again, so um, I fixed it. And so it should be secure now. This is going to be my last update because I don't want to keep on doing this. Um, yeah, so he is complete. So, just look at him in glory. In his glory. I have to get rid of that stain and, you know, the other stains, but. And there's his OG logo, which I love. And, yeah. Maybe if we hit with 300 subscribers, I'll get the other option, which was the Sabidiana uh, Nintendo 64 plushies. Maybe, if they're still available by then, probably not, but. Or like maybe I'll get them separately and then make them up, but like combine them for a video. Oh, maybe Mario Party 5 Bowser, or Mario Party 5 Plus in general, maybe. So yeah, so um, yeah, so that's been it. Like and subscribe, and uh, bye bye. Thank you guys so much for 200 subscribers. See ya. It's me, Mario. Thank you, Charles Monet, by the way. Woohoo!